Here's the G spread. G here stands for government. So it is the yield differential between the yield of the corporate security and a comparable government security. Now, what we mean by comparable is maturity have to match. That's the G spread. I spread here, the letter I stands for interpolated. So here we're looking at the corporate yield over and above the comparable swap rate. Then I've got the Z spread. The Z letter here stands for zero volatility. So we are assuming a constant term structure of interest rates. Now, what the basically means is that we're going to be given the spot rate curve for the benchmark risk-free security. We're going to take into account each individual spot rate and slap a certain cushion measured in basis points, and it's going to be a constant cushion, uh, in order to force the model price to become equal to the market price of the bond. That'll be the Z spread. That Z spread is going to, of course, account for credit and liquidity risk. 